What is going on guys, Tiswaf here, welcome back to some more End of Earth. Now last time we left off was the first episode and you guys seem to really really love the series, so I'm very excited to continue on the series, so uh, first of all, you guys told me that this backpack was really really nifty and apparently, I did a little bit of research on it and apparently you can you can actually wear it, so if I, if I right click it without like looking at a wall and selecting a wall like that, if I right click it like that and hit this button, apparently that means I could wear it and there you go, that looks absolutely insane and there are these little tubes on the uh, on the right and left side of it, I think I can open it up by hitting B, yep there we go. Uh, I think I could put like water and lava in these here and then they'd fill up those tubes and on the bottom right corner you can see there's those two tubes there I think that's what it's for so that is definitely really interesting I I still don't know what these two green ones are but uh, the rest of this I guess is storage space and of course here we have the crafting table so we can make like sticks there and stuff so there we go that is really really awesome I'm, I'm going to put up some some coal in there and maybe uh these sticks I'm going to put up everything in there I don't need right now uh let's see bones yeah I put up up there I'll put those up there too let me see do I have any extra wood in here might as well get a little bit of wood Anyways, for this episode, I definitely have planned for us. Actually, do we have any? Yeah, we have a little bit extra iron. Real quick, I want to make myself another iron pick because we want to go mining this episode. Uh, the reason why we we want to go mining is because, of course, we need a lot of minerals. We need a lot of like resources to make a lot of galactic craft stuff. We need to make like us. Was it like a? solar power panel stuff we need to make like a lot of those and get like a solar panel farm like set up so we need to keep digging downwards and uh yeah this is where we came across the oil and stuff so let me see let me get a bunch of that cobblestone i have let's just patch that up let's just try and like circumnavigate this let's just go around it real quick so <laughs> hopefully we can find a cave over here and uh i'm judging by the minimap i'm not seeing anything any any like big gathering of mobs so i don't know if there's a cave anywhere nearby so hopefully there will be so we can get a lot of good resources and ooh, what is this more ruby ore i think i think i remember this from uh from attack of the b team as well as like tech it or technic this is really awesome i think you can make uh tools out of it i don't remember if you can make armor but i'm pretty sure you can make tools out of it and they're like they have like the same durability as like diamond or something do i have a shovel i don't think i made a shovel yeah i guess not so i guess i'm not going to get that gravel out of my way but Ruby, that is definitely going to come in hand for you. handy. I don't think it can break the same stuff as diamond, but I think it just has the same durability as diamond and can break the same stuff as like iron or something. Uh, I'm not a oh 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 oh. Is this a oh? We found a cave. Oh, that's awesome. We found a cave. Let's see. I see one zombie that might be close by, according to the minute. God, the silver ore? Are you kidding me? Every time I see silver, I think it's diamonds. I'm pretty sure they used a the diamond texture for that. Ooh, there's lava. I'm pretty sure they used the diamond texture for that and just like like recolored it a little bit just to, just to kind of fool with people and it always gets me it always makes me a little bit too happy I'm like oh my god I found so many diamonds that I find out it's just dumb silver oh skeleton I need to make myself an iron uh an iron thing an iron sword here if I don't already have one and I keep stepping on these dumb bushes I, I keep forgetting these dumb bushes give you damage, so I need to stay away from those. I need to remember that I made a mod pack and there's a lot of stuff that's completely different from vanilla Minecraft. So let's see, we need- I, I have a lot of wood so I can just make a lot more torches if I need more. And I'm, I'm getting pretty low on torches, so there you go. Uh, maybe I'll make myself a ruby, a, uh, a ruby, uh, sword. Maybe that'd come in useful. There's a lot of fossils down here. I don't think we're going to be messing with any dinosaur stuff anytime soon, but- Ooh! There's another deposit of, uh, of this oil here, so I definitely have a lot of oil for Galacticraft to, uh, fill up our spaceship once we get that up and running, but we're definitely going to need a lot of this, a lot of iron, uh, I think we need, what else would we need? Does this have too many items installed or something? Oh, yeah, yeah it does, okay. So if we go to, let's do at Galacticraft, is that gonna, whoa, there's a... There's a lot more stuff in here than I remember from spacecraft walkway. I don't remember that being in here. Must be because I don't have the uh, the planets thing installed. Advanced solar panel, basic solar panel. Is that going to give me? The, yeah, that's going to give me the recipe. So compressed steel. That is, uh, you smelt down iron to get steel, and then you get like a compressor thing to compress it down in the steel. Yeah, we need an ingot compressor for that. So steel ingot. So we can either, I guess there's steel ore here maybe. Maybe there's steel ore, or we have to smelt down iron to get steel. Which I assume it's the, the former, we have to smelt down iron to get steel. Or, uh, we have to smelt- yeah, we have to smelt iron to get steel. And that's the only way you can get it. I don't think there's any steel ore. Although if there is, then that would be super useful, because that would save us an extra step. But, uh, as far as I know, I haven't seen any. 
But uh, if I do come across any, that'll definitely change my mind. Now, I am hearing some spooky skeletons. Let me see. Let's make myself a ruby sword. Yep, there we go. Ruby sword. Oh, that's the oh, I already have an iron sword in my inventory. Nice. What's the damage on this one? Eight versus six? Oh, don't mind if I do. Eight damage. You get ready for this skeleton. Get ready for that eight damage. I see you down there. There you go. Get some juicy hits. Oh, look at that robot skeleton. Two robot skeletons. Two. Oh, man. I just killed him. There we go. Another skeleton. Yeah, you're going to die there. Come on. Come on. Yo, what armor is that? That's some really good armor. God, that's doing a pretty good amount of damage. There you go. He's dead. <gasps> diamonds. I'm really sure that's diamonds. That is diamonds. All right. I didn't want to be fooled there again because I know I knew it was like tin or steel or something that, that was tricking me all the time. God, that's something I never get. Why are these bushes not like burning in the... Oh, wait. Those are the... That's the XP bushes. Those will definitely come in useful. Not maybe not right now, but maybe later once we get some experience stuff going in the future. Might want to might wanna bookmark that in my mind. Uh, come back here later and get those whenever I need them. But I don't need them now, because, oh, that's death. I should have known better. I should have known better. Don't dig straight up. Oh, it's one of those rules of Minecraft that I didn't even follow it. Oh, wait, could that oil get rid of the, uh, of that? Huh, let's go to my backpack real quick. Let's see. I don't know if this is like a smelty thing. I want to, I want to see if that is or not. We can make a bucket. So if we come across, uh, some water, some regular water, we can definitely turn all that into obsidian, but as far as I- Oh, oh, more diamonds! There we go, nice! Oh, is this- this is some volcanic rock. Ooh. Don't know if we're getting close to a volcano, but I will gladly take these juicy diamonds real quick. Fossils, uh... I guess the only thing the fossils are good for is that, uh, whenever you mine them, sometimes they'll just drop regular bones. And that could come in useful for that farm I want to make, because we did- We did get a carrot from a zombie that died on episode one, so... Definitely want to get a farm up and start uh, up and running sometime soon, but I don't know if it's going to be this episode or maybe the next. Most likely the next, because we're, we're most likely going to just keep mining this episode. Exploring this cave, finding all the good stuff and the bad stuff. And speaking of good stuff, let's get these juicy diamonds. Actually, let me eat real quick. I want to regen. Just in case anything tries to sneak up on me, I'll at least have full health. Did that, did that skeleton drop any of his armor? Steel chest? <gasps> he did! Durability? HP, what is this at? Oh, yeah, that's almost broken. I'm putting on that steel thing. So we have steel boots and we have... Okay, how do you craft this? Is this just steel? You just use steel for that? I'm hitting R and it's just rearranged by inventory. You kidding me? Uh, uh, heavy duty leggings. What if I type it in here? Steel. Or, oh, there we go. Let's see, steel armor. Is that in here somewhere? Yep, here we go. Let's see. Is that just crafting with steel? God, stupid thing. There we go. Uh, you can make it with- you can mix and match it with iron, really? Ooh, so it's not as expensive as I thought. Now that is really nifty. Gonna have to eat some more of this disgusting rotten flesh if I want to keep regening. Alright, so that is pretty dangerous there. Let's- let's make a safe- safe- There we go. Let's make it a little bit safer. Get rid of some of that lava. There we go. Don't wanna- don't wanna be above the- above the lava like that. Mmm, juicy diamonds! God, how many are we going to get? I think we got two from that other vein. And we've got, ooh, ferris ore. I don't, I don't remember what that is. I don't know what it's for. We got some more of this fer- Actually, if I remember correctly, isn't this kind of rare? Huh. I don't know. I'm going to try- Oh, another diamond up there. We'll see if I can get this with iron. I can, so. Let's see. What are the uses for this? Uh, ferris. Where is it? There it is. Uses. Pulverized ferrous metal. Hmm. I don't quite know what you can use it for. I'm not I'm not that into uh into the uh, Tinker's construct and all that thermal compounds or whatever other mods are in here. I am not too familiar with those kinds of mods, but maybe oh I definitely need aluminum for uh, Galactic Craft, especially because it says it's in the Galactic Craft mod up there. But I definitely feel I can get used to some of this stuff by the end of this series. So that'll be definitely awesome. Feel free to be, uh, leave tips in the comments down below. I'm always open to read some tips. I always read the comments. And uh, if you guys want to give me some tips, feel free to do it in comments. And there we go. We got a lot. We got a little bit of the the aluminum. We got some iron. I still don't know if you can smelt in that backpack. I guess not. I guess not. Hmm. I kind of want to head upstairs. Maybe get this stuff started smelting and start getting the Galactic Craft stuff started. That's probably our first mission, we just need to get some of the Galacticraft stuff started. I'm pretty sure we can get some of that stuff started a lot better if we did some of the... some of the Tinker's Construct type stuff, but... Sadly, I don't know too much about that, so... 
I do know about Galactic Raft because I did that in Spacecraft, so let's try and do that one first. So the first thing we need for that is a, I think it's, let's see, at Galactic Craft. We need a, what is it, cold something, something that, electric compressor, that's not it, right? It's a, it's a regular, just a regular, no, one of these, coal generator, there we go. So we need some copper, aluminum wire, which I think you need wool and aluminum to make that, iron ingots, and a furnace. So that should be really easy. That's going to be our first power source to uh, cook all the stuff. Uh, actually, we can cook that up to a furnace or an electric furnace or something. Get that, start smelting some stuff, or we can just smelt it the old-fashioned way in regular furnaces, but that will take a lot of coal. So I think I'll just rather use, uh, actually this will use coal as well. But, uh, I guess but until then, or until we can get a solar power thing, we're gonna have to use a lot of coal, so... I guess any coal I get, or any coal I see, I'm gonna have to get, cause... We're gonna be just spending this coal like crazy once we get all this stuff up and running. Alright. Ooh, I'm kinda glad I mined that coal, we got some more iron right here. Alright. Now I think we've only explored like one, one direction of this cave, so... I kinda wanna go to that area we came out, maybe, uh, try and... Try and, like, put a bunch of torches nearby so I know that's the entrance of the cave. Or that's where we came from so we don't get lost. And, uh, god, what is that? I don't know what it is. Uh, more iron. God, there's so much iron. You can never have too much iron, apparently. Definitely can't, because you need a lot of it for Galactic Craft. But, let's just get as much iron as we can. Let's not try and, like, get every single vein of iron. There's some redstone. Because we obviously cannot get that just yet. Well, let's see. Where in the world did we come from? Did we come from up here? No. Is this where we just- yeah, this is where we just were. So, we came from maybe over there. I, I- I'm trying not to sprint, but I guess I have to real quick. So, we came from over here, right? Oh yeah, there's lava there, so I think I came from over here. And, yep, there we go. Alright, let's- let's build a little staircase up there. Alright, let's put a little- little few torches next to this, just so I know that's where I need to go. And I need to make some more torches. All right, let's get uh, let's get some more torches up in here. There we go, twenty-four more torches. All right, so as I was saying, there's another pathway over here that we need to explore. Is that something? Nope, it's just some more uh, permafrost apparently. All right, God, look at this. I keep th I, I thought this was a gigantic vein of diamonds, but it's just silver, just dumb silver. I'm not even going to use that for like ever. I don't even know if I'm ever going to use it. Is that you? Yeah, that's uranium. Wow, <laughs> wow. I don't think we're going to be using that anytime soon. Ooh. Pretty big vein of rubies, don't mind if I do. Hello there, squeaky bat. If only I could tame you as a pet, I would tame you as a pet. But alas, I can't. And we just got a bone right there. So that is definitely going to help out with our little farm that we want to set up later. So this just goes down back here. And there's some more rubies. If I do find rubies, yeah, I'm definitely getting that. But, uh, <laughs> iron, eh, we can always come back down and get it if we really need it, because... As I said earlier, we, we already have a ton of iron. We have 35 in our inventory right now. If we That's going to take quite a while to smelt, but... Uh, is that really just one iron right there in that little vein, really? <laughs> that's pretty embarrassing. I need more than that. Okay, let's go back upstairs, actually. Let's go up here. And maybe even test out our little theory about farming. I want to make sure I could farm without, like, our crops getting, like... I don't know, contaminated by that disgusting water we have up there. I don't even know if you can grow crops. <gasps> there's a there's a zombie villager on the mini-map. Look at that. Oh, it's nighttime, so let me see. I think someone also said that this thing doubles as a bed, so if I take this out, that little thing, if I right-click it on the ground. Uh, yeah, there we go. There's a bed right there. Alright. Oh, oh, yeah, look at that. You can actually sleep in it, too, instead of unlike that bed over there that just sets your spawn. Alright, so there we go. God, that's so nifty. It's a sleeping bag, isn't it? That's what it's called, right? Uh, it doesn't tell you. But that is totally a sli- Look at that, there's a little sleeping bag, like, rolled up on the backpack right there. That is so cool! God, I love this. It's so nifty. Okay, let's put that back on. There we go. And we- yeah, we're getting pretty low on food right now, so... If we can get some, uh, some food up here- Do we have our carrot? Is it- I think it's back in the chest, so... Let's see. Let's get the carrot out of the chest. Yeah, there we go. Uh... It's our only carrot, though, so... If it gets con contaminated... Uh, we're probably gonna have to kill some more zombies and, uh, try and... Try and get some more carrots and maybe potatoes later, so let's see. Let's make ourselves a hoe real quick. There we go, get some sticks. And can we make a ruby hoe? I think maybe, right? <laughs> yeah, look at that, you can make a ruby hoe, that's cool. 
Let's make a shovel. Let's make a ruby shovel. Oh, look at that. We got eight diamonds. So there we go. Ruby shovel. So let's just... Okay, there's no zombies trying to touch my butt right now. So let's just dig all this out. And there you go. This should be a pretty good amount of space for us to put a farm. So let's see. Let's, let's, let's just till this one. And there's a carrot. Okay, it, it just placed perfectly fine. Oh. Let's bone meal it. And... Is it... Oh, it's regular... Okay. Okay, it looks like farming works just fine. Oh, man, I'm so glad. Oh, let's till this land. Plant these two other carrots. Let's bone meal them up. There you go. Come on. Oh, man, how lucky is that? All three carrots grew with only two bone meal. Still, I'm still kind of sour about them uh, nerfing the bone meal, but... I guess, I guess it's kind of fair. I guess it's kind of fair. Alright, let's get rid of this. Let's put a dirt there. There we go. I probably should have set up my iron to smelt while I was doing all this, but whatever. There we go. Let's just use up the rest of our bone meal. There we go. Let's get those on a head start. Okay, so let's see. We need to get rid of this. Oh, that's, that's copper. That's what we need for the, uh, the Galacticraft coal generator thing. So we need that. So there we go. That goes down to there. Then we can put, uh, put some more dirt here. Alright. There we go. And I, I think I can make this... Eight? Eight wide? I think, I think it feeds four... Four blocks. I think water feeds four blocks. So I'm going- I can make this eight wide. If I have another water source. So there we go. There's another four. And there we go. Let's just put down, put down the extra dirt there. Okay. Alright. So let's see. Let's get this. Let's fill this up so it's not like draining like that. There we go. There we go. And there we go. And I think I said that I wouldn't be doing farming this episode or wait. Is this is it why isn't this like correcting itself? Does infinite water pools let's see. Infinite water pool shh. They didn't fix it, did they? Okay, what? It's not wor is it really not you kidding me? What? Oh man, they like fixed it where Water's like, is there like a mod here that says like water's finite? Okay, let's get four of these. Is that? I am really, I'm. And then we get that. Oh, it doesn't. God, it's no more infinite water pools, really. Ah, oh, man, I'm sour. Ah, oh, I've got to take out these zombies. Get out of here, zombies. Die. Yeah, keep keep drinking that toxic waste. Ugh. I'm gonna eat these delicious carrots. Well, I guess I will whenever they're done. But God, I'm sour that that water is. Forever toxic. Let's see. I forgot. Let's let's pick it up in the bucket real quick. Is it going to be toxic inside the bucket? Can I put that in my backpack? Oh, it is toxic waste bucket. Ugh. Ugh. Gross. Can I put that in my backpack? Was I? No, I can't. Okay, whatever. I guess I can only put water and lava in my backpack. Which I guess I might as well only put lava there because I can't get water unless it's underground. Which I haven't come across that just yet. Hmm. <sighs> Yeah. Alright, well, let's smelt all of our stuff. There's a little bit of iron. There we go. And just one gold. Eh, I don't think I should waste my time on that. Uh, I guess I'll put that up here. Let's put all this stuff up here. Might as well. Might as well. Iron sword, just in case. Let's put these up here, because we're not going to be using that for a while. Put the di let's put the diamonds in here and the rubies. Yeah, there you go. And I think... I think we're good to go. Alright. Well, let's head back down. God, I am so hungry. Give me that rotten flesh. Gonna have to om nom on this disgusting rotten flesh and head back down into the caves. Where hopefully we're gonna find some more stuff adventuring down here. While all that smelts. Uh, preferably we'll need aluminum, iron, copper like we saw up there. If we find some, some of that orange copper, we need to get some of that because that is for our first little machine we need to build. And we can't build that without copper, so we need to get that. Let's get some gold. Oh, oh, look at that. Got some more rubies. Glad I got that gold. Alright, let's keep getting this. Now, I don't know, how, like, where certain ores, like, spawn, other than, like, the regular Minecraft ores, so I don't know if, if we're at proper copper level, or if we need to go down or up to get some copper. So, let's just, let's just keep roaming around, and hopefully, we'll come across some copper that we can use for the, uh, the coal generator thing. So there was some lava over here. I want to myth bust something real quick. Let's see if we can get rid of the uh, the lava by using this toxic water. Hopefully we can, because that dumb toxic water is the only water we have in the game. So 
Unless we can find some regular water and for some reason the infinite water pool thing doesn't affect the, the regular water, then I am, I am super glad. Oh, that's on fire. Are you kidding me? Is that, why is that on fire? <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh, oh, it works. Oh, stay out of it. Oh, man. Oh, okay, okay. So you can, <laughs> you can actually use this to, uh, oh, can I just get rid of it by just doing this? Yeah, there you go. You can actually use it to get rid of lava. Okay. So here we have, no, somewhere, we saw, I saw some, some of that oil around here somewhere. Let's go get some of the oil, see if we can pick it up with a bucket and see if it just turns to water. I know it's somewhere around here, I can hear it bubbling. I don't know if that's the lava bubbling or the water, I don't know. Oh, here we go, here we go, let's get some of this. Can we pick this up? Oh, we can't, oh, come on, I just want to pick up the oil. That's all I want is just the oil. Ugh. <sighs> Well, I guess we're gonna have to wait until we can find some regular water, and hopefully, hopefully the regular water works like regular Minecraft water. Oh.